Welcome to lecture two. In this module, we're going to predict the ripeness of a strawberry based on an image of the fruit using machine learning. In this video, I will show you the resources that we will use. Visual Studio Code is again our programming environment. The project structure is as follows. The data folder will contain images of strawberries that will be used to train our algorithm. Then, we also have two example strawberry images that we will use to test our algorithm. As usual, we have an indexed HTML with a simple user interface. In the barinet.js file, we will write all the machine learning related code. As always, we use the live server extension. For the machine learning part, we will be using the TensorFlow.js library. This is the JavaScript version of the TensorFlow Python library that is used by many data scientists all over the world. Next to being a framework for deep learning algorithms, TensorFlow.js also gives access to pre-trained models. We will use the mobile net model for image classification. In addition, we also use the KNN classifier for transfer learning. This module is heavily inspired by a tutorial on the TensorFlow website about transfer learning image classifier. If you want to know more after following this module, you can also follow this tutorial.